Recently, as a matter of fact, yesterday for the Southwest, yesterday will be Sunday, where we say people wake up, bath, rub cream for body, pray to God, say thank you, God, for waking me up this morning. And that they go to church, go worship you, and thank you for giving me on that day to take worship you. They enter church for on those days for a war, only to meet their end. Who will ever reason such? So looking at the matter where they are before us right now, we get to do it. Insecurity and the fact that people, they die like foul for Obodo, Nigeria. This very strong question they ask, we get to do it. What will be the value of a Nigerian life for Obodo, Nigeria? Now they ask, because your blood say we know they value life again. Because of some kind of selfish interest or individual interest, the issue of life, we don't, dis- we don't classify as chicken. People, if they die anyhow, I will care less about it. On top of us, the hot is now what we want to look about. Now, this matter, we want to talk and want to discuss. I will also bring in our guests much later to also follow us here on this matter so that we could see where will they head, where this country actually they drive go. My name is Chair. My name remains Unkubi. Welcome to Ask in the Heart. On top of Ask in the Heart, now solution to problem now we define. Bam. As my brother Unkubi don't talk, our Ogun girl visitor, not be ordinary person. He know they work anyhow. Now person won't be say, when he reach to find solution to problem, now I mean they come out. Mm. And they talk of Oga Dennis Amakri. Mm. People won't have security for inside this country. Once I call the name, it thing go sound for their ear. Oga Dennis Amakri, now person will be say, he starts from small, reach the highest level for inside one Ogonga intelligence, security intelligence agency inside Obodo, Nigeria. And the person will get over 32 years experience as a security expert. He gets the one where we say, in the run, no, based on say knowledge plenty. And he goes, still they use them, they contribute to how they will solve the problem of Nigeria. Now, why we don't carry and come to the Ogaden is Amakri? So, back in Chukmat, for the matter when we say, we they discuss. Uh, at this juncture, we could just talk, say, our heart, they go out to the people when we say, they lose their loved ones mm. uh, for that sad incident that happened for St. Francis Catholic Church, for inside our town, for those state. May God give their families the fortitude to bear their irreparable loss. But now, solution, I will discuss a lot of us in the world. Oh, God, Dennis Amakri, welcome. God, Dennis Amakri, make no waste, I make just go straight into this conversation. Make I ask okay. you, as somebody when we say you get plenty of years of experience, as somebody when we say the time when you even dead, yeah, they do the work. Everybody knows, say, not the small work that you they do. You they use your whole mind, they do the work. When you hear the story of that sad news, what happened for inside St. Francis Catholic Church yesterday, make I ask first, what will be your initial reaction? How you take reason the story? My initial reaction was sad. Hmm. Very, very sad. Because you see, uh, these uh, security agencies, even police, well, the DSS, if you remember very well, one month ago, then we put notice, say people wait there for church, people wait there for mosque, should be very careful because, you know, they don't get uh, intelli- what they call intelligence, say something will happen. People will go want to come and attack church, attack uh, mosque. And then when that kind of thing happened, the church is supposed to do something. You know, I even said that to many churches when I know, eh? Make them try to do something because security now everybody worker. Security now everybody worker. Not be only say we go begin the wait for uh, police. If your house they burn down, now you go first begin quit fire before fire service go come. So they would have done a lot of things, but they don't do them. And then of course the people let uh, begin kill everybody. You know, plus children. And it is so sad. It is sad well, well because, in fact, till now, I just the worry. Ogaden mm. is Amakri. Nobody won't go hear this kind of badness. So when no go there, very very sad. But make we go back to the very beginning of this particular matter. So you don't tell us say about a month ago. This Ogbonga security agency for this country where we say that they see what it, we get two eyes, then get four eyes. One of their eyes they front, another one they back. One, they look left. One, they look right. It gets this when we say, then they see. And then they issue warning. 
for this particular badness will happen for broad daylight, for afternoon, where the sun they shine. For community where we say, not be near bush, oh. Now community where we say, if you walk enter, people go not say people they walk enter. I won't ask. She now say, the intelligence no done. The time where we say, the supposed done commodity for fire. Or, now mistake when they happen normally, uh, as it takes concern intelligence gathering. It, it done well, well. Like I told you, this thing don't, you know, if I tell you, say, Ray, go for. It depends on you to begin look for if your house they leak, you know where to patch up. You know, they don't talk up. So this kind of thing go happen though. Make gonna take precaution. And nobody take that precaution. Hmm. Till now, as I talk with you now, many churches, many mosques, just they open like that. We know say that open space. People go they enter, they come out, they enter, they come out, they don't care who they come in. And then, of course, the people, another side of this story, we say, the people waiting for that town, they're supposed to open their ears and open their eyes. Because, you see, if I can tell you, we there for war. Many people don't know say that war we did so. We there for war. And when war they happen, not the only army, they fight that war. Everybody, they fight up. Now, they will tell people, say, come on. We see some people where they walk out one kind, you know, I don't like the face of uh, all the way where they, they walk out there, Kurukera walk out where they call walk out there. I don't like them, you know. So now from that kind of information, when police and the DSS go do something, you know, all these people, DSS, police, they have not been magician. Mm. Now information that they take walk out, you know. So it is very necessary to say we include everybody because... We they talk about this one now. After one month or two months, another one will happen again. Mm. And people will still be for where they did. Mm. To avoid that kind of thing, make we start from now. Begin mm. to correct this problem we will get. Okay, Oga Dennis, um, you say make we start from now to so correct anything will happen in the future. And this particular information, if you look at it, at least um, the DSS and the people with the government first get first-hand information about this particular matter before it even can eventually spread to the places where it's spread. She, on the side of the government or on the side of the DSS, she knows also to say maybe they know also probably play their role effectively to make sure say, the information go out properly to the people so that they will not say this matter, what they talk about, so it is very serious. I mean, I say they just slightly put out that information. And apart from that, she knows also to say on the side of the DSS, they're supposed to conduct an underground investigation to know where the source of this information comes from so that they will feel avatam before it goes spread out. Okay, back I'll tell you how the thing they work out. You know, if I know, say, it could be somebody who won't kill you. Mm. Eh, I mm. hear the thing. When I hear them, I go try to inform you inform people where they for your house inform you so that you know how to take care of yourself mm. remember say the person never do the thing but you go do it and until you do it the person no guilty because we they look you know for our kind of society now everybody they not guilty until it's proven to be guilty mm. so we will begin to follow the person because let me tell you, the thing when SSS come tell us, they don't already, besides telling us, they don't begin to also pursue them. Then they pursue those people. They keep an eye on them. They pursue them. So sometimes, you know, they don't go fit cover the whole Nigeria. That's why they, they expect people when they for Nigeria to also put hand for the matter, to make sure say, when these people don't start their own, we go show them, say, na lie, or na no fit enter. Hmm. But I still they talk up. Make all of us they what they call security conscious. Make we know about security. Hmm. Okay, Oga, 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 then may, may I further push this question? Because um, of course, it is very appropriate for everybody to get first time, at least make them get information about uh, security. But then if a people where we say they don't even know from their left to their right, they don't even know what to be the security things that they suppose they look out for. 
And especially, they don't carry all their trust, give government. So government, so, now you will know, make you protect us. Make you make sure, so you give us the right hand kind of information to know what you will go feed the look out for. And this will not get this kind of information. And this kind of thing can't happen. Shame on the people where this thing happened to go blame. I've been on the people where, we, of course, the government, we, know, we don't fail to also ensure that they put these people properly with this kind of information so they will feed their own alert on their own. We don't go blame the people who become victim. Hmm. You know, we can't blame them. It's like the thing that happened for Kaduna. When they train the Waka, the bomb bomb, take some people hostage, go put them somewhere. You can't blame those people now. Hmm. Eh? But you have to now, government supposed to be responsible. That's why we they talk, say, when anything happened, the primary objective, the thing will, will make government to become government, or what they're supposed to do as government, the first thing are to save life and property. Hmm. You know, so that one, that government work, when government get to do. Hmm. And then, of course, when things like this, they happen, besides telling people what will happen, you say, go, go ahead, do what you're supposed to do. One thing where many people don't know, we say, look, we, we, we get police, but police, they, you know, my problem they with politicians, because now that they, be, they, go, now that they go get the government, hmm. they know they go give these police people the, the thing where they go use to solve the problem, or even the DSS, you know? It be like say the mechanic where they where they try work on moto, you don't get a spare part, but they try to the dark one to do something to make sure say the moto worker. Mm -hmm. That's where the security agencies they do now. Mm -hmm. eh? Now look at it. Where security be the major problem? What did they do? They they spend hundred million. They they do politics. They want to come become president. They want to become uh, this and that. But their house, they burn. Eh? Now, something don't happen there. So, you know, they go there to for a war. Because they give them 50 million, 70 million, like that. Why you don't take that one? Take help the security people so that they go ready, mm. do their work, you know? But that is the problem we are getting now. So, we will continue talking about it until... You know, they encourage the government, encourage the government to do what they're supposed to do. Okay, then he said, um, your answers, they point to the fact, say, many Nigerians, they, they, they look the situation and then they say, if the people were supposed to help us, not to help us, mm. share now we go come and help. And you don't talk and rightfully here, say, you don't go blame the victims because... The reason why they be victims now because of say then they're helpless for the situation in the first place. But if yes. person go meet doctor uh, for clinic, doctor mm -hmm. go ask and say how the thing they do you. Mm -hmm. Now what I want to even they call diagnosis. Now you go explain say maybe I know they feel chop things they swell me for my throat. The doctor will come begin mm -hmm. they touch some one or two places they ask questions to find out. Now you be our doctor here. Now you yeah. experience wise, knowledge wise. Career-wise, now you be our doctor. And the problem of insecurity for this country now something where we say, we don't carry come your clinic. East, West, North, or South. Nowhere for Nigeria, they safe. If we look the different manifestation of insecurity, even if na kidnap, or na whether kidnap for ransom or kidnap for ritual, whether insurgency, banditry, terrorism, unknown government, courtism, violent gangs, Insecurity, they everywhere for inside this country. If we won't find a solution to this problem, dear doctor, Dennis, doctor of security, or God, Dennis Amakri, what will be the first step when the government of Nigeria go take federal, state, and local? Very good. You ask better question. You ask better question. So the thing we say, the kind of problem we will get now, we need to, everybody, Market woman, or volcanizer, or uh, civil servant, everybody and must be on duty. Because, you see, security starts with you. You will be the person. Now you, where do you start with? If you sit down for your house, I'm robbers come to your house. You don't go wait, say, 
Oh, okay, we get police, so we don't pay police. Make I wait for police to come. Sometimes they don't feel rich there before the arm robbers finish waiting they do go. Mm. So you will get the house. First of all, let me tell you a simple one. If you get house and you feel say you want secure them, the first thing you go do is to come out for the house. Lock everywhere, come out. Then when you come out the house, walk around the house. Look at how you fit enter the house. Either through window, through door, through roof, look at the house. Look where you know they strong where somebody fit enter. Mm. Then when you don't finish that one, go inside the house. Come the look inside the house. How somebody fit run out. You have to know all these things. Mm. Many people go like, for instance, for Nigeria, they go build house. Come take a burglary proof, cover the whole house, finish. If fire start inside the house, they don't fit come out. Mm. So this like I T is where we go to. Security starts with you. Now as it starts with you, let's go out to things like kidnapping. For kidnapping, you 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 have to watch yourself. Make you know day where you know where where you know supposed to day at any time. Mm. We know say kidnapping day for town. Then I will come go club, go stay inside club oh, around three, four, five. I will be in the calm house. Mm. Maybe I don't drink myself. Then I don't go know whether somebody they follow me or not. I fit enter trouble that kind of way. Mm. So no, say because town they hot, make you stay your house. Mm. By six seven, you don't enter house. Mm. You know, and they don't always they look around because they, they, what they call a situational awareness. Mm. Situational awareness. Mm -hmm. Anywhere you do, you did look around. If something happen here, how I go manage come out? Mm -hmm. You need to know that one. How I go manage come out for here? If something, if anything happen, stampede, people begin run or do anything. Mm -hmm. Anywhere you did, know how to get, know where you did, okay. wherever you are. Mm -hmm. So you do that one for kidnapping, you know what you need to do. No begin the travel for road, you know, say the road no good. You are going to uh, uh, Abuja by road. And you begin the drive from night. Eh? That one like Juju now, mm. you won't go kill yourself. Mm. You won't commit suicide with that. So make you know how to work up when things they happen. Mm. For your house, body tree and everything, and information that be the major paracetamol where you go take the cure information when you hear something you say something when you see something you say something okay okay then you say i mean i like the fact say the matter of insecurity you bring them down to the people say they need to actively they involved make they also they open their eyes to a lot of these things and make I also bring your mind to this every year government they bring up budgets so okay oh, see this budget now for this one this one are for this Majorly, it blasted the entire project or a larger chunk of the budget will they get. Then they channel up into ensuring, say, then secure our country, Nigeria. If we get a system where a government wouldn't carry such kind of big money, put for insecurity or rather to ensure, say, they provide security for all Nigerians. And Nigerians on their own part, do they get any share of this particular money to take, protect themselves or to they look out? Chino also to say on the side of the government, somehow they probably don't fail because for somebody to decide, say, okay, make a they put an eye on my house to so they watch, they watch, they know who they work at or who they come in. The government supposed don't play their part of ensuring, say, even before that person even comes to my door, they don't stop the person somewhere based on how much and the amount of money which they allocate for ensuring say they secure the country. Yes, you know, say. Uh, we don't fit, uh, even they do budget. Some people they say, ah, make we share the money now. So, security budget, make all of us share so that we can secure ourselves. Uh, the way they do it like that, you could use the security budget, take for finance the uh, security people, police, army. And you are very correct. Majority of the budget they go to defense. Mm. 
That's how to secure the whole country. But you know, politicians, even soldiers don't come out, talk out. So sometimes the fish say, okay, how many billion, billion, now we hear about even the soldier, police, DSS, the money where they go reach them. Eh? You will hear say, they never allocate, they never allocate the money, uh, they never back them up, and all those kind of things. Hmm. So that's why we are talking, say, politicians, sometimes they cause this problem. Hmm. They cause this problem. And that's why we are in the season now. I better say we will talk about this thing for now. This is the time when, if you don't like what the government they do, get your PVC, go vote. So that you can vote out the government where you, uh, where you, you don't like, vote in the government where you like, or vote the government where, the way you like, make it stay there and do the job for you. You know, so these are the kinds of things. Nigeria is going to get involved in politics, but politics is everybody's business, too, just, just like security. Ogaden hmm. hmm. is a Macri. You they hit the points one after the other. Uh, and you don't come for points where we say, this one has something when everybody here go stand up. Because every time we go here, this amount, that mm. amount. In fact, our budget, because you don't make them clear now, say, one thing not to budget, the other not to appropriate, to come out the money, make the release spend, and not be to call plenty billions. That they release the billions, because the police, where would they see? The, the motor when they drive, the, some people when they use ropes, still tie their gun. Not be like billions, billions, when they hear, say, government they release, because the result, what they see, not be here. Maybe we can't talk about one particular amount where we say, every time when they talk, I'm like, say, governors then go begin, they shout, hip, 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 hooray, mm. security votes. Damn. That yes. money when we say, it not get accounts. Mm. Nobody yes. they check them, but we know, yes. say, people they collect them. Okay, yes. then it's a these security votes. I don't know whether you follow them, they collect the team. I don't understand because now security money for a head. How then they do that security vote? They can tell you. Tell us. They can tell you. Yes, you know, anytime they do budget, besides everything, they give you money for road, they give you money for this, this and that. They will say, okay, there's also security votes. That is to make sure because security you know the plan. It is like accident. If it happen, something if it happen, just like it happened for one hour, hmm. you know, uh -huh. there are security things when they're supposed to do. But governors will know what they do. Go we'll call the head of uh, DSS. You we'll go call the head of police. You we'll go call all the army people. You we'll go tell them, say, come, oh yeah, what will be the problems we we'll wanna get? Besides, you know, say. Their own um, uh, agencies also they give their money, but as soon as they hear from my state, what did I feel do for that to help for that for the work that they do? Some will tell you, say, okay, uh, we uh, we need about uh, ten cars, but not only five they give us. You know, governor will say, okay, I will give one another five. Not gonna take put do what you are supposed to do. You know, and they are okay. Our house, our generator, uh, we don't get fuel. If police they call us now, make we call, they know fuel for the motor to go. You go give them money for fuel. That's what governors, when know what they do, they use the security for they do. Some governors go carry the money, put inside their pocket, like their hey. pocket, pocket money. You know, many of them, because they know. That this money is not accounted for. They will just put that for their pocket. It don't become their pocket money. Hmm. So that's the problem we will get. Some of them, even their local government chairman, you know, they will staff them of funds. Hmm. This is the problem we will get for the structure of kind of government we will get. Hmm. So these are areas where we're supposed to uh, look. You know, like I told you, many people, many Nigerians think say uh, democracy will we get now only election. Democracy is not the only election. Democracy, the participation, government of the people. Now we get the government by the people. And we they do the government for the people, now for us. So until Nigerians start to learn 
how to begin to get involved in all these things. You know, because if I can ask you, you know, say if you get a senator when on a, a center of which if you don't do anything, you know, say you get power to call her, make it come back, mm -hmm. remove her from that senator. Mm -hmm. Do you know that? Yes. But many Nigerians no no. Many Nigerians no no. So they go just they, they immediately they enter the office, they don't become king. Mm. And then everybody go they go meet them. Ah, welcome, sir. Welcome, I go carry somebody, give you. Mm. I will be happy. Say, ah, this is it on a better man. Mm. But you are supposed to do certain things where you never do. Very true. That badness will happen for inside St. Francis Catholic Church for our town, inside Ondo State, yesterday. Uh, according to plenty of reports, we don't come out, uh, the number of people will be said, don't buy, uh, the number past 30. Some of the talk say that number, even plenty past that one, oh, but now something when they very, very heartbreaking. Some updates about that particular story now say, uh, Plenty of people don't condemn the presidency of Nigeria. Mm. Don't condemn. They don't also promise say the perpetrators, that is the people who do this badness, say then go bring them to book. We don't know whether na higher education or na 60 leaves or 20 leaves, but they say then go bring them to book. Some important people for inside this country, uh, like people who want contest to become president, when they don't condemn some things before, delete them. So when they even they talk before, them too don't condemn this particular one. In Kamala said it in the follow format. We receive with shock the news. We condemn. We bear with the people who have lost their loved ones. Then finally, new gist. Uh, donations, don't they come in? Presidential aspirant on the platform of the All Progressive Congress, Ashwati Bola Ahmed, you know, who visit uh, the place when this badness happened. He give 50 million uh, to the victims. He also give uh, 25 million to the church. The Nigerian Governors Forum, uh, their president, or Gaka Yode Fayemi, Kari Waka Godia too, himself give the one when we say, in one give. But the most important thing now say, uh, make we secure people's life before they go. Because no amount when you give go bring life back. Now the first part of what we discuss with that, just in case you just they join us. Now we'll go move to the second part. We talk security votes. We won't go talk now, say wait. The person when they receive and when not do what he's supposed to do. And the person when they give her, who be the person when be saying, oh, what's pass? Because if you they give, the person know they use them. Mm -hmm. And you see they give the person. If you like say something that happened between them. But before I ask our Google for that question, remember we go open our phone lines. You self go call and talk. So then I lecture with they because the person when we say they give us everything we concern solution to the problem of insecurity for this country based on the experience in be professor. Okay, Dennis, let me come back to you now. This security vote when we say, then go put hand inside pocket. Money will belong to all of us. Give states them. We don't even get balance. The states don't even they send their account balance. We know they know how much the thing be, but then they collect because everybody don't claim, say, then they collect. The person when they collect, I wonder they do what you're supposed to do. That one to get problem. But the person when they give this money, call. Because if you they give money, you expect to see the results. As you they give, the person know they use them. Say, you know, you never know, in the time when government will talk, say, we not give you this money again. Or the one we don't give you now, make you bring record to tell us what you don't use them do. I be, you not go work. That, you know, when you look at uh, government budget and allocations, you know, the security vote, when they talk about, is a non audited account. Hmm. They know they, they know they go audit them, hmm. you know, and it has been like that because many people believe that, oh, security, uh, the thing when I go do for security, I don't want other people to know about it. So if you audit them, you will know where they use the money they go put. That one should be left for security agents alone, not the, not with the governor, not with the governor. So you know, you, you, you remember say, some kind of governors like this, immediately they come out from, uh, you know, so they get immunity. That means when they do for office, you know, if you do them anything, immediately they come out from go, uh, government, EFCs will come pursue them. Uh, many of them like that. Some of them now because of this security vote, when they no fit account for, hmm. you know, because that the money where they just they use. Like I tell you, some people just they say that money that their pocket money, where they take they do whatever they like, you know. But not even that one alone. No. If we go to like these uh, legislators, uh, uh, legislators and the senators. Uh, they what they call constituency allowance. 
that constituency allowance, that money, whether they give them, whether they would go back to their local government, go open up feast, hire some people. And that's what they tell you, they see, democracy is not the only election, no. Because they were supposed to build house, get office, put people inside, employ people inside. Like you now, if you get any problem, you go go to that, to that uh, uh, constituency office. Mm. Then as a CEO, our area we don't get light. Our area to this road, you know, the road don't spoil for many years. Nobody they do have. Now that office where you go complain, and when you complain, they will come, send them to the senator or the house of rep man. Then he go call, take and go to the minister of works or minister of this or that, minister of uh, power. God tell us, look, for my state, these people never get light for talking something like that too, so that the thing will just, you know, you understand. Mm. Because that way, people have contributed their own. And that way, the thing could work. Mm. But here, they go take the money, they go put it for their pocket, nobody, they even, how many people, they go meet their senators say, this is our problem, I better call solver. Mm. They know they do have. Teenagers mm. go come home when they like. Some of them know they come home, they go do for Abuja. When they come home, you will just they move around, give money to people when they like, mm. and then they will go away. You know. So we, the people of Nigeria, are supposed to wake up, hold these people responsible. Because we know it, the government no go audit the account, but we fit make them to spend them because. We need to tell them, say, Kobo, we know our right. The money they give you to do this thing, you never do it. What did they happen? Mm, very important question. The money we will give you, you never do it. So this one just, it just, it just clear, say, those will be the victims mm. of this kind of badness or insecurity. Now we the, now we the people. And those will go enjoy everything, they okay. Now we the people. So we must play active role in, in holding our representatives them accountable because Oh, only That's them go get convoy, security, this, that. They do one, 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 they know they do traffic. One, 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 one for road. But we, the ordinary people, go there at the mercy of bad people. So, hey, our Nigerian people, when they for us, I don't hear them. At all levels, we need to hold our representatives them accountable. And they ask them the all important question to find solution to our problem. Me, I can't ask this question, or God, then, Mr. Mankari, because this question, they very, very important. You get one big English when and dollars they use that they talk about interagency rivalry. Mm. You go answer this question after we take this call uh, from our caller, Samson, when they for Kaduna. Oga okay, Samson, welcome to Asi the Hot. Kasina. Kasina. Oga okay, Samson, you did there? Yeah? If I say we don't lose them. So Oga okay, Dennis, we can ask the question. The question I say, with the year of interagency rivalry, when they go talk, say some people no one share information mm. with another security agency. Or then they drag who be the senior, or who pass, pass, or who get power pass. And this thing don't make us fumble sometimes when it comes to say we could solve the problem of insecurity inside this country. Make I ask first, that interagency rivalry. Now, true say if they happen, I've been mean, just big, big English when they use number one, then number two. If it they happen, oh, how we go take we find solution to that problem? Oh, okay. Um, the question who they ask, oh, what would they discuss now? Very important issue. And um, we they ask Ogaden is a macri visitor the question of interagency rivalry. When mm. they say interagency, mm. it means agency when they're on their own and how then they relate with each other. Mm. And make a break that make people understand. When they look at our security architecture for inside the border Nigeria, we get the military, we get the paramilitary. Paramilitary mm. now, police. That's the military when no complete. Mm. Paramilitary. <laughs> Maybe the, the para when they're in front and they make police to the para sometimes. Maybe we all come out and the para just yeah, said them. Pa, pa, military. Pa, military. Pa, uh, but military. if they put pa, military, they become the way like people don't hold. Papa. Go pa, don't hold. Oh, uh, that level. You know, that's go call police. Police, they are robbing us. Ooh, Maybe you could just have. You. No, let the military. Okay, you understand? military. Uh, okay, then it's back to the question when we say uh, we won't ask. We they talk about interagency rivalry. Mm. And now they ask whether interagency rivalry not true, say if they happen. I mean, I talk when people just they talk. Then number two, if it happen, what do we go to to find solution to that problem? Okay, intelligence rivalry they happen. Mm. 
They happen well, well. Uh, let me tell you, the Baba, the, the mother of all the security agencies, the police, hmm. you know that one? Okay. Even the army, now from police, they bring them out. DSS, now from police, they bring them out. Hmm. EFCC, custom, immigration. So you find that uh, most of the law enforcement agencies and security agencies now from police, they bring them. But what did the police, the, the politicians come to say, when they bring them out, they make the ones when they bring out to become stronger than the mama. Mm. So these ones, you go find out, say, when they bring out DSS, uh, they go come pay them better money, mm. more than the original police where they there. When they bring out the EFCC from police, the EFCC people go to earn better money more than the police. Hmm. And then, of course, what did they do now? We say they go down, allow you to they compete among yourselves, hmm. whereby, you know, all of them, like, they get one master. Hmm. They get one master. And the master is the president. Hmm. So all of them, they struggle. When they get information, intelligence, all of them, they struggle to go gear to Oga. It's just like Papa waiting for house. Uh, uh, Papa Nami cut the grass. So, oh no, Papa Nami fetch the water. You know, uh, Papa, I help Mama Kuko. Uh, you know, so you they are all trying to like impress the mm. Oga. Mm. You oh. know, and as they do that one, you know, they, they begin the uh rivalry they go on that's mm -hmm. why sometimes you go see say uh police will get information when they go give her me but they don't go give them they, they hold up then they go tell the papa mm. you know so if they tell the army now army for go ahead and do the thing quickly and then that problem will come out but they go they wait you know hold on tight now it be the rivalry when they get and the problem when they get but right now the present service chiefs we will get for Nigeria have put their head together under the office of the National Security Advisor, mm -hmm. where they now they talk to each other. Mm -hmm. In fact, we, we suggest say that they get what they call control center. Okay. Control. Uh, or, or there is no vex, no vex for also. We'll With that information, we we'll go hold on. We get Emeka. Emeka, they call us from Lagos. Emekus, welcome to Asili Hot. Okay. Now we're done there. Yeah. We're great to you, Mecca. Uh -huh. now, we're, now we're done. What I want to say there is that the man there said that security is for everybody. Mm. I agree with that. But I don't know how we can secure ourselves individually. Only when we do anything, there's no problem. So we can be able to cut up for ourselves. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I want to ask him for that because he says about it for everybody. Okay, Thank Ebekus, you very much again, Ebekus, Ebekus, we don't get your question. Okay, then is like say <laughs> what the Ebekus they ask now say mm. if security now for everybody, <laughs> but now only maybe police, army, air force, navy, the whole something. She make everybody begin the whole uh, something. Uh, make it, make it, maybe say Nabo and Haru. Uh -huh. They're going to this get people. Because so, the yeah, one in the they angle, and Haru. The angle when they carry this talk for you, they talk say, okay, yes, if security now for everybody. Uh, and our security yeah. forces, they hold something for security reason. She come and say everybody go hold something. Mm. Even if not the one when they go put for pocket, just uh Igboro Kigo, Igboro Kigo. Something thief, eh? like that. Mm. How you take reason the matter? Now, you know, the thing is that this gun issue, this gun thing, is not very good. Mm. It's not very good. I mm. tell you, uh, you know, because when I did service, I carry gun. Mm. I did sleep with gun. I mm. did wake up with gun. Mm. But I'm trained with it. I'm trained. I am trained to, I know how to use them. Mm. You know, police wear no service sometimes. Some of the police will never go rage because every three, three months you're supposed to go to rage, go shoot the gun, mm. learn how to use them properly. You know, so some people will never go rage for a long time. If it go, shoot themselves. Mm. That's one thing. Number or shoot two, the common man self. Or shoot somebody else. Mm. 
you know, I work for a company where we get mobile, where they drive with driver. Then they escort people to go airport. You know, the policeman who hold the gun for this thing. He don't put up for safety. Hey. They enter a up like this bad. The thing just shoot, shoot the driver for a leg. You know, so this gun, we are not going to encourage people because let me tell you, if in America where if you are 80 years old, you can go into any shop, buy a gun. And you're now, if you listen to American news, you go, you go here yeah, say somebody go just enter inside the oh, supermarket, God. begin to shoot everybody. <laughs> go to school, begin to shoot everybody. Mm. You know, uh, so it have mental capacity to hold gun. Mm. You know our Nigerians. Mm. Okay, then if, okay. Yes. Okay, going by what you talk now, we know say yes. You be mentioned earlier. Say security not for everybody. Yes. And based on how our law they take work, say, okay, people not get license to say they won't hold gun. Okay, mm -hmm. if paraventure, for instance, now, maybe mm -hmm. something can they happen, yes. which kind of technique or which kind of skill an individual like me, looking at my height, I yeah. want to take, I want to take counter who they enter okay, my house. You're supposed to even ask this question now. People where you hold gun, they talk. You no, where, make you, where you, are gone. you where you are uh, gone, we, we hey, know. Don't, don't tell me I'm gone at the same it's time. Okay, it's okay, okay. Like <laughs> so for instance, I mean, what kind of skill will somebody like me will be citizen? We know they trained. What kind of skill I want to take there, I want to take they protect myself or defend people when they bust into my house? It could be before we start this particular conversation, you already, you already suggested one method. Mm. Bow and arrow. Hey! Eh? Bow and arrow. Bow and arrow. Let me tell you something. Hmm. Yes, bow and arrow. Hmm. You can even use poison bow, uh, poison arrow. Shoot anybody. Hmm. Within how many minutes, you go don't die. Let me tell you something. Before we begin to get gone, what do you think they will use? Hmm. Anybody, how people will be protect themselves, go to Calaba. Every adult, we don't reach adult. He get knife, long one, cutlass, mm. under a bed. You know, you should use things when the logo say you need license to. Mm. Do you know that even when somebody try to attack you, the key bunch, bunch of key where you hold self the weapon, you know that one. Mm. Yeah, because there are many things you can do with that bunch of key. Mm. You know, so there are many things. It doesn't have to be gone. It doesn't have to be gone. Mm. And our temperament is no good. Mm. Our Nigerian men now, they, if you come house, a wife never cook food. You don't come back from work. You don't vex. You carry God, you shoot a wife. Ah. Because food never ready. Mm. Uh, I would drive for road. I, I pass you. And then I nearly scratch you. Hello, everybody come out, they shout, do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? If you get God, what do you tell me what do you think you're gonna do with that God? So it needs mental, you know, capacity to carry gun. And we don't go allow people, it's not good. We don't go because people when they carry gun anyhow, like Americans, then they get problems. Even last week, they go to school, shoot children. You know, for nothing, for nothing. So carrying government is not a problem, but there are what we call non-lethal weapons. Non-lethal. Weapon will go kill you, but the weapon will go disable anybody. Mm. Pepper spray self day. Mm. Uh, all kinds of things. Even women when they walk up for road. Inside a post, if you carry pepper spray. Somebody wants to attack her or rape her, she must bring her spray her for eye, you know. Somebody wants to break into your house. You hold your knife, wait for her. Mm -hmm. eh? If you enter one kind of corner where you don't stay, you don't go see you and say, enter, you summon the guy. Mm -hmm. You know, um, um, so the point is that we can protect ourselves. Mm -hmm. Ogaden is Amakri, thank you very um, much for the plenty of wisdom when you say you don't share, give us today. Yes. From the position of government, from the position of we, the people, mm. uh, and the agencies of government, then when we ensure all of us, they safe. You don't talk up uh, as it take concern the responsibilities when everybody gets out what you go do. We appreciate, say, you come here, come share your wisdom mm -hmm. with us. And our prayer, although I'm not a man of God, but our prayer, and I say, 
God will give you more wisdom because now people like you, now in this our country need, yes, especially at this kind of difficult time, experience, love for the country, mm. and most importantly, that ginger to continue. God bless you, Ogadenis Amakre. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you very Mara much, Ogadenis. We appreciate.